Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hey, we got it, it's, it's hot. All right, 2024 box of the year. Just kidding, we're in 2024. Um, anyways, hey guys, I'm looking at this X5 Pro. Now, I didn't wanna just throw another Tangula video out there because I knew this was coming down the pike. You know I do like Tangulas. Tangulas, Tangula, whatever. Uh, but this is their new 2024 X5 Pro. We're gonna get a look at it today. This is a four gig RAM with 128 gigabyte internal drive. Now, when I had a chance of playing with this and I tested it a bit, you're gonna wanna stick around and see what this bad boy has to offer. So let's get on with it and I'll show you what's included. Here we go. Let's unbox this bad boy. Now, on the side, it's all hard to read, but it's gonna have Android 11. It's a 5G uh, wireless. It has a USB 3.0. It has an 8K Ultra HD, four gigabyte RAM, 128 gigabyte ROM, which is the storage. You have a thousand M ethernet and a voice control remote x5 pro that's so much for that one here we go comes in its little uh thing there i'll put that over here so it has a nice little velvet almost like a velvet painting but anyways it has a little wrap on top okay now let's go ahead and go we got the Five Pro, right there, right there, there it is. Okay, we have a user guide, user manual, manual. Simple stuff. Oh, user guide, mm -mm. <laughs> Easy enough. Normal stuff. Okay, it comes boxed in all kinds of things here. Okay, so now we got all these boxes. Set that aside. Okay, it has the old remote right there. That's it. Uh, this is a 2.4 uh, Bluetooth wireless that comes with it now. It's an air remote. Oh, I like that. About the same size. Uh, but this is their setup. Okay, I like this. You have on and off your mouse pointer, your controllers here. You don't, oh, well, you don't even hear them. Very little. Uh, plus, minus, minus, plus. This is your back and forward to your uh, home, your microphone. So this is your microphone remote. We'll just take that right over here. <laughs> well, that's nice they give you the old one. A lot of people don't like these some, for some reason. I don't know why. Um, but you have uh, your hotkeys, which is Netflix, YouTube, Prime Video, and App Store. I kind of like that. I actually like that a lot. But no batteries. Inside here is your dongle that you will use on your, I would use a 2.0 on the back. If I did it, I'd put it right there. So what I would do is I would actually, if I was gonna put extra storage, I would use one of these like these Samsungs. They are fantastic. They work great. They're cheap. Uh, this is 128. Fits in there so you don't have it, you know, a thumb drive sticking out like that. You also have a uh, SD card reader here. But we'll go over that in just a second. But that's your remote. All right, let's see what's in the other box. There we go. That's it for that. So you have the antenna. These work pretty good. Um, I have not had to use one because, you know, I got a router that's pretty strong and I actually have never had to use one. Um, but you also have your LAN port so that you wanna hook up directly to the internet. Okay, it's own power, which is a five volt, two amp. There we go. And then uh, HDMI cable they give you. Now let's go ahead and go over this. I'm gonna take this back out, but remember this is a 128 gig storage, 
you could put up a two terabyte on one of these, um, you know, that you can buy and put it in here and it's gonna run it on here like it's nobody's business. All right, here we go. Um, let's go over these, what it has. Now this has a, the SD card slot. I usually will use this slot. I'll put a, like a whole bunch of music that I like uh, and I'll put it in there and uh, I could play my music over the TV and so forth over the system. Comes with the USB 3.0. Looks like a reset hole right there. You have the USB 2.0, the LAN, HDMI, the uh, optical uh, sound, and your power input. Now this does have holes through it. I think it feels aluminum. I like this, I really like this box. And you have this on the front is a uh, your display. I like this top on it, that, that's kind of nice. It doesn't have that big tangula in red. I, I, I like this kind of look here. That gives you what it looks like on the front. Uh, just a small clock, which is great. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and get this thing hooked up and see what it'll do. Okay, as you can see, we're here in the interface now. It really is uh, the normal startup method to get to it. But as you can see, we got uh, the Play Store, KDMC, which is a uh, KODI <laughs> duplicate with more stuff in it. Uh, Firefox, you have wallpaper, you have uh, YouTube, you have the normal file system. Uh, let's see what else apps they'll have these all lined up in here um, yeah everything normal stuff TA store is where you're gonna find your uh, you know where you have to go in it tells you what to do uh, I have already done that through the tang TV and so forth these uh, programs here come with it uh, what you need to do before you do anything before you uh, you have to authorize the box which is in here, as you can see, activation. So you just know where that's at and so forth. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at settings real quick. It's on my network. Uh, you got apps and device preferences. Let's go ahead and take a look at that real quick. About, uh, it's a X5 Pro. Uh, X5 Pro, yeah, running on Android 11, as we know. And let's go ahead. If it needs a system update, you click on that. Uh, Bluetooth, uh, you got date and time, whatever you want to set. Keyboard, okay, display and sound, storage. You are looking at 4 gig of RAM and 128 gig storage. It's going to tell you what all you got in there, uh, which is enough room to do pretty much what you want to, but you can always add on to the storage on this. So no big did there. And you got a screensaver, energy saver, you have developer options. If you do not see that, then there is a way to do that, uh, to get that on pretty much all Android boxes and so forth. Uh, if you want to know that, please put in comments that you want to know how to do it. And I will tell you how. Uh, location, accessibilities, and restart it. Now, we got more settings here. Hardware monitor, auto start app, which is going to start in whatever app you want uh, whenever you light up the box. Uh, Netflix. Now, it plays really well on this. Uh, uh, but yeah, this is uh, a paid subscription. Of course, if you watch one of my other videos, it'll show you how you get like 80% off paid, but, um, but this is Netflix. It plays well, except Netflix or back to the screen, uh, Surfshark. This is the VPN. Now this is Surfshark, uh, VPN. Absolutely fantastic. I suggest you put this on everything you have and it's, you know, one charge or, you know, one account and you it takes care of all your devices. But this uh, really works well. <laughs> Anyways, I put that on uh, every box, uh, everything I have. 
Okay, then you have, it comes with Tubby TV, or Tubi. Um, your normal, uh, your normal YouTube. Very nice, very clean. Fishies. Yeah, it uh, does well. Let's go ahead and uh, get out of this. You know what YouTube looks like. Now, if you want another app right in this section here, just hit the plus button. Find out which one you want. We'll just do that one. Since it's right there. And then it puts you in that line right there. And if you ever want it off, you just go ahead and go plus again and click on that again and uncheck it. And it's gone. Now, most of this is normal stuff for you, but let's go ahead and uh, take a... Now, it also has a Play Store, which I'm not signed into, but it's a normal Google Play Store, so you can get all kinds of stuff down from that. Now, this is their uh, software, the Boxes software right here. Um, you know, this being a YouTube friendly, we really can't show it, but I'm going to... I have to blur out some stuff on it, so... Okay, this is their interface uh it's a nice interface i like it you have your live tv set up it has the movies and i'm here for the series you have a catch up here uh favorite and live with epg so any of your favorites will show up here so it's a quick access if you need it you have a 24 7 online uh qr code so that's Excellent. They're, they have fantastic service. Uh, like I said, I had one problem with one lady once, and that was it. Here you can do multiple screens. Uh, so if you want to have like four uh, football games on or what have you, this is, uh, that'll do it there. Uh, if you want to search for something, you have the live TV setup, the movies and series and settings. Now your settings on this, Here's the settings I like. Uh, I don't do, you know, auto start on boot up. You can do that. I'm not a big fan of it because I do so many other things with them. Uh, but you have active subtitles, um, auto play next episode. I don't like, um, but yeah, it just kind of, and it has a nice player. Uh, you go EPG, you go stream format, parental control, which is nice to have because of, uh, you know, the spank division, <laughs> uh, actually it's, uh, you know, the R rated and up and so forth. So automation now it's, you can set this to different days and so forth. So let's go back up here and go, I will set it to seven days down. Set it for seven days and just click on save changes. Now it won't do an update for seven days. Time format, player selection, player settings, external players. If you want to uh, use something else, the VPN, it's nothing. Speed test, multi-screen and switch device mode. Put it on TV. Okay. Let's go ahead and get back out of here and let's go ahead and, uh, Let's just jump into movies real quick. I'm just going to show you the, the program layout because I can't show you what's on the right hand side, but I can show you 89,785. Yeah. So you can go down here and you see all the genres, uh, exactly what you, what you're looking for. I mean, it has movies in Germany. Uh, I mean, this thing is worldwide. And that's one of the things I do like about it because we do have a, I do have quite the following of, you know, a lot of other countries. So that's kind of cool. And let's see, you have adult, private, VOD adult, lots of adults, I guess. Uh, let's see, movie races, NFL movies. Um, yeah. That's cool. And let's go down to series. And if we look up on top, 13,127. Uh, genres, uh, the normal genres, all the way down. Uh, Spanish, German, Portugal, 
uh, sports series, handy, um, ones we can't say, uh, French series, multi sub series. Um, all right, let's go ahead and hit up live TV. Okay, I'm not gonna hit okay be <laughs> because I can't show you that. Um, but as you can see, it has 11,155. That's, that's a ton folks. Okay. So here is your genres on it. Um, I'm just going to scoot down and you can read them off. If you need to pause or slow it down, you can do that on your player. And, but it's going to tell you all the stuff that you're going to have. Yeah, this is where favorites comes in. <laughs> That's the problem looking for, uh, you know, programming when you have so much, it, it just isn't, uh, takes a while to find what you want. Once you do, but you can look for any of the countries or anybody out there that's asking, is it for my country? Well, here you go, because I'm, I'm. I get that question asked almost every time. So in case I missed anything there. Okay, we'll just keep going. Okay, there we go. Uh, more spank division. And it'll say remove from favorites or start recording. Now this does have the recording function where you can start recording, put in your 60 minutes or whatever it's gonna be, uh, browse where you want that recording to go to and click on start recording. It's that simple to record a program. Uh, let's go like this and go remove from favorites. You see that heart disappear. Now. After you record something real quick, I'm going to show you there right up here in the top right where you see the it says record, click on that. And there's where all your recordings will be. All right, let's go ahead and go back out and we'll sum this dude up. Okay, guys, my opinion on this, um, if you can tell I'm drooling a little bit, uh, <laughs> this is badass. Okay. Uh, I really like this. I think it performs well. I think it'll probably do anything you're gonna to wanna to do. And you know I like Tangular products anyways, but this was worth waiting. You know, I like this box, I like the look of it. It's sleek, it's small, it can go anywhere with you. Put it in your pocket. So my opinion is, well worth the money. Uh, if you don't know what a fully loaded box is, we can only do a friendly version on YouTube of what this box is until I see something new come out from everybody else. Here we go. Tangela did a hell of a job. Uh, the programming on it is second to none too. I mean, uh, you, you know, the programming on most of all these boxes are about the same. Uh, some have a little bit more, some have a little bit less. Some have a number of programs with Tangela. It's one program that kind of, it's one to carry them all. Hey, look, guys, if I give you any value with this, please give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate it. Hey, if you don't know how to get in on our giveaways, check this video right here, guys. You're going to like it. Um, it's going to tell you everything you need to know about it and what we can do for you. All right. Until next time.